Welcome to Bedroom Forensics. Now we don't usually talk about food here, but who doesn't need an excuse to maybe go and grab that pizza? Because usually we get told, eat five a day of fruit and veg. But what if you eat too much veg? Can you die? Well, yes. The most famous case is in 1974 and poor Basil Brown. He wanted to eat well. And as a scientist and a health food enthusiast, he took on a 10 day carrot binge. Now he started in February of the same year and drank about 10 gallons of carrot juice on top of vitamin supplements a day, taking in over 10,000 times the recommended requirement of vitamin A. Now the 48 year old didn't stop when his skin turned yellow or when he had severe stomach pains, he was addicted. And when he died, Dr. David Haler, the pathologist who performed an autopsy, said that the effect of the enormous intake of vitamin A from carrots and tablets was indistinguishable from alcoholic poisoning and produced the same result. He said that he had cirrhosis of the liver. Now, as I said, basil is a rare case, mostly because you can't really overdose on carrots themselves. The carrots don't contain vitamin A, they contain beta carotene, which the body converts internally to vitamin A. Now, beta carotene itself is harmless. So without the added extra of the vitamin tablets, you could eat a lot of carrots, potentially turn orange, but it probably won't kill you. But an overdose of vitamin A is possible and records show that by taking one large dose of 200 milligrams of vitamin A or a chronic use of more than 10 times the recommended daily intake will make you super sick, give you nausea, headaches, rashes and bone pains and can obviously kill you. Now one thing to seriously avoid is polar bears. I mean, avoid them in general. But if you happen to be offered some of its liver, just say no. One pound of polar bear liver, that's a, a fist sized chunk and barely a meal, can contain nine million units of vitamin A. Now we cannot put that through our body. So more than a couple of mouthfuls and you're out for the count forever. And while we're on the no-go animal livers list, Seals and walruses are just as toxic, so just don't, don't do it. Now, the annual report of the American Association of Poison Control Centers National Poison Data System showed that in 2018, that nearly 50,000 people had adverse effects to all sorts of vitamins. However, none died and only five had serious effects. Now, it's clear that anything taken into excess is super dangerous. Too much vitamin D, which is found in sunshine, can have devastating health effects. And they not always are gonna show up straight away. It's not until months or even years after starting to take those high doses will there be any effects. Vitamin D toxicity is a buildup of calcium in your blood, hypercalcemia, which can cause no nausea, vomiting, weakness, and frequent urination. Vitamin D toxicity might progress to bone pain and kidney problems, such as the formation of calcium stones. And most people do get enough vitamin D from their diet and a walk in the sun. So think about taking any supplements. Go to your doctor if you're worried about not having enough of any vitamin or maybe having too much. And whatever you do, take care and avoid the polar bears. Offs. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe.